For the sulfate test, you need your deionized water, sulfate reagents 1 and 2, the sulfate sample, pipettes, and empty glasses included in your water drop kits, equaling the number of different water sources you are testing. You have a control glass, as well as a glass for the water source you are testing, and for this demonstration, we will only be testing the local treated water, and so we will only need two cups. To begin with, you will measure 25 milliliters of deionized water into both of the empty plastic cups. It is important to keep the pipettes using, being used for each separate cup separate and to only use them in their own cup. To begin with, for the control cup, we will take two milliliters of water using the pipette and add it to the control cup. Next, we will take sulfate reagent number one and add it to that control cup. Next, we will take reagent number two And we will add that while swirling the cup to the control cup. You'll continue to swirl that control cup for approximately one minute. Once it has been swirled for approximately one minute, you will set it aside and move on to your cup of water filled with the treated water sample from your local source. For this sample, you will add the two milliliter sulfate CGLS included in the test to the water glass. Next, you will add the sulfate reagent number one. And again, while swirling the cup, you will add sulfate reagent number two. You will once again swirl this cup for approximately one minute. Now, in order to perform the test, you will compare the cloudiness of different cups to each other to determine the levels of sulfate present in the water. 